Who the fuck are you? Oh my god. That's a boss. <laughs> Did I just stumble onto a boss? Come on, bro. Oh! Okay. I got budged. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Twin Tail Gaming. My name is Dio, and we're back with the second episode of Jedi Fallen Order. We have Cal standing here in front of this spaceship with his impeccable hair. I must know what product he uses. Well, we've been told to head over to that temple. So we'll have to make our way over. And look at all these cuties over here. Oh my gosh. Where are you going? I'm going to pet you. Can I keep you? Oh, they're running away. Um, we have gained a skill point. I've got one, uh, the one in the top right. Um, but I don't know how to redeem it yet. I don't know whether we have to go to a particular place, so we have to do that meditation save point thing. Which I think is over here. This looks like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind. Okay, let's focus his mind. Safe points. Safe points are located throughout Cal's journey. Make sure to interact with them to save your progress. Safe points are where Cal can rest and spend skill points to acquire new skills. Okay, I want to go to the skill tree. And I can... Okay, that's the only thing I can actually do at the moment, which is to learn... The overhead slash. What? Okay, wow. So it's like a power attack. That appears to be using a force. Which is a bit strange, but okay. Can increase his maximum force. Holding slow allows Scar to slow his target for a longer duration. Dashes forward and attacks his target. Oh, Cal can perform another powerful attack after an overhead smash. Carl's defenses are improved, allowing him to take less block stamina damage for incoming attacks. And Carl's maximum life is increased. We've got another one here. We've got a, an evasive kick. It's pretty cool. And attacking out of sprint allows Carl to perform a special lightsaber attack. And I'm guessing all the other dots there we can see that are, are going to be other skills. But we'll just go with this for now. Uh, do I do I rest? Does that mean it's am I saving? I think I'm saving. Let's leave. Okay. Oh hello. Hey, BD one. I'm Cal. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a. A Jedi, I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on. Did you just slice that? Thanks. Hey, thanks, buddy. Oh, he's so cute. Okay, nice. We get to climb these. I can already see I'm going to die to fall damage a lot on this mentioned. game. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. Oh, you've given me a little map. It's really cool that it's uh, the little robot, BD1, that's uh, projecting this as a map. So yellow bits, I'm guessing, are places I haven't been to yet. That leads to another area. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, it's not... Okay, so zoom, zoom, and then rotate. Okay. It's actually forcing me to do these things. Also, she has unexplored pathways. Okay, yeah, so... Yellow is unexplored. Safe point there. There you go. I'm ready to go. Do you want me to go that way? Are they friendly? They don't look very friendly. I want to go this way. Those creepy lizard things. 
I sense something over here. What do you mean you sense something? Where? Over here? Is it a Pokemon in tall grass? Could you imagine? Do 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 do. Looks like we've got some weird creatures down there. They're definitely really aggressive. Bug. That is a big bug. Oh, ho, ho. I'm gonna slice you up with my special attack. Oh, okay. We, we're seeing some slicing. Finally. I'm guessing it's just because uh, the stormtroopers are like humanoid enemies. The game's like, nah. We want to remain child friendly. Not allow you to slice up human targets, which is, yeah, fair enough. Oh, what the hell is that? That looks like a giant grub. Why oh, is so gross? Oh, I can't hit dead bodies. What's this? Sense echo. It was after boggling eggs in the pack fought back. Oh, okay. It's one of those uh, dead blocks. Through a rare a psych a psychometry, no Cal can warning. receive information from Force when he right, touches certain items. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty uh, interesting Jedi power. I've never heard of that before. Not sure whether it was made up for this particular game or whether that's actually a thing in the lore. Don't know. Let me know if you guys, if you guys think. Like I'm pretty big on Star Wars, but I don't know everything. Gotta get across this gap somehow. A zipline? A zipline. Do I just jump? Yes, you do. Oh, thanks, BD. What a cutie. Wait, you didn't? Can I meditate here? Uh, I'm not gonna save. Open sesame. Nope. Okay. We go through this way. I hear you, but there's something over here I want to explore. <laughs> yeah. I'm with you, Cal. Oh. Yeah, that's cool. What is this place? Oh god. This is getting... That's dangerous. Oh my god, there's another one. Sent an echo, let's go. The Jedi used this place to study the sphere above. I can still feel the excitement. Ah, nice! I turned them all off. Okay, so we have to. F we could find these bits and bobs, and they uh, increase our maximum force, which is super handy. I'm sure. Can I? Can I climb on that? Do you think? Nope, definitely not. How do we get up there then? Hmm. Maybe another way in. Uh, how do I get get back? Can I just? Grab onto this or something? Am I stuck here forever now? Oh shit. Uh. Well, not that way. <laughs> uh poops. Oh wait, okay, hang on. You can climb this. I can climb up, cool, and then I just go, oh yeah, you're slow. Can this still hurt me? No, I can't. Climb, Cal, climb. It's pretty cool, these little puzzles that you get in the game. You have to use your force powers and whatnot to, uh, to get past them. It's pretty cool. Huh, okay, nothing that this way. Some bad guys over there, but I don't think I can get there without dying. Can I 
Can I slice it? Yeah. You can hold this to. Oh, that's freaking cool. Who needs a flashlight when you've got a lightsaber? Although it's a bit odd that I put it down and suddenly there's no source of light. Who the fuck are you? Oh my god. That's a boss. <laughs> Did I just stumble onto a boss? Come on, bro. Oh! Okay. I got budged. Oh, wow. If you die, you lose all the XP the game uh, since your last point. Well, that was harsh. Back for round two, baby. Come on, you stupid thing. I'm taking you down. Ah, nice. Come on, then. I don't like that my lightsaber just seems to be tickling this fucking thing. Come on! <laughs> you guys just do the same thing over and over? Okay, I can do this. God, I hate that charge so much. It scares the shit out of me. Oh! Come on, Oogla 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 I don't know what to call it. So close! I don't want to die now! Oh my god, this thing scares the shit out of me. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! Take that, you stupid fucking frog! God, this thing is horrible as one of the first bosses. <laughs> Holy shit, look at all that XP as well. Was killed. Is it trying to defend its family? Is it one of those cute things? Aww. Killed one of the cute things. Can we... Oh. It's locked. Well, at least we got a shit ton of XP for this stupid thing. I'm not gonna kill you again. I mean, I'm pretty sure it was intended for us to come back later. And take it out. But, uh... I just... I just can't not fight things. I don't like leaving things. It was a pretty... I, it did take me a few tries to actually take it down. But uh, it was... I just found it so inconsistent in its animations. Sometimes the uh, the sort of leap attack it has, the charge up was just... It would take longer than it should, almost. Like, And sometimes it was a lot quicker than others. So that would just lead you to die. Oh, enemies every... Okay. Oh, okay. So it kind of works similarly to Dark Souls. If you rest, you sort of reset the area and enemies come back. Should I follow you, Careful buddy? Over there. That doesn't look safe. Oh, God. He's so cute. Like back at the scrapyard. Drop down. Oh, bad guys. <gasps> nice. BD one's a hero. No. Don't hurt BD1! Bastard. Oh, there are more of you. Come on, then. Who else? No, okay, no one. How did you get through there, you brave little guy? Hey, that was pretty brave. You okay? Oh, he's hurt. Wait, I can help you with that. Will you let me? Oh, look at his little leg. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> okay. Honestly, droids are like the droids of Star Wars are just the best. Hmm. Well, your scomp link is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. Cal the handyman. Okay. Try that. Ah. Yeah. Yeah, that's where I was headed too. Okay. Well, first we gotta figure out a way out of this place. For sure. 
And I want a droid companion in life. That's a little small for me. Don't worry. I'll find my own way out. Can we can we not go this way? I wish I could slice doors open. I do have a lightsaber after all. Let me grab that. I do like the whole Star Wars aesthetic. Whoever lived here used this room for storage. They kept food and supplies. Ah, right, cool. We got another skill point. Don't know what to put it into force or life. Probably life. Tight fit, but this should work. What should work? Ah, nice one. Thanks, buddy. Much dark. Okay. Those vines look like they lead somewhere. They Hope do. They're sturdy. Can we not explore this place more first? Guess not. Not much here. Let's climb. Uh, should I be going? I think I should be going right. It's very dark. I'm sure you guys can't see it either, but I can't see anything. Oh, this way. Okay. I am going the right way. Might have to edit that so it's... Oh my god! My bad. Shit. Yeah, I'm alright. I can heal. Yes, please. Healing stem. You're full of surprises. <laughs> what a legend, this little guy. That's better. Thanks, little droid. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> yeah, let's try not to get electrocuted. Uh, okay. <laughs> Here, hop on board. How is he holding on? How'd you get here? With replenishable stim canisters. I've never known a forgetful droid. Can't argue with that. You can now access his polo map at any time. So red is blocked, green is available, safe points, and unexplored. Okay, that's pretty cool. Ah, can you open this for There's me, sir? Chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? What you got for me? <laughs> I like how BD1 goes in there. New emitter acquired. You can change lightsaber parts on workbenches throughout the galaxy and on the Mantis. Nice. So I think we just unlocked like a shortcut. Yeah, we did. That's pretty cool. We can come back here That's later. Where we need to go. I can feel it. Nice. Got anything to fight? Yeah, bad guys. Let's go. <laughs> Just slice you in half. Whoop. Now that's satisfying when you just cut them in half like that. I just wish you could do that to stormtroopers. Shion. <laughs> that is so satisfying. It reminds me of uh, how great sort of Jedi Academy was back in the day. You could slice through anything then. Are we going for a ride? Yes, we are. One of those weird lizard things. mapped everywhere we've been. Certain paths will be inaccessible to Carl until he possesses the right abilities. Oh, you can switch elevation. Well, that complicates things a little bit more. So we can't go forward. I can't make it over there. We gotta find another way. Alright. I am ready. 
Surely not. Oh, okay, I can go down there. Zoom. Okay, I'm gonna stop doing these sound effects because obviously the game has its sound effect has its own sound effects. Don't need don't need me to do that. <laughs> Just rummaging around in there. New poncho. Love a good poncho. Can I change it? That looks ridiculous. Oh, Tarzan style. Another safe point. Another checkpoint. Oh, we've got another skill. What do we want? Do we want dash strike? Jump while dashing to flip over the target instead. That sounds pretty cool, but I think we're just going to go with more health because I suck. Need to be able to get take more hits. Another echo. This tool was used by someone eager to reach the vault. Okay. I think there's anything more that way. I guess we can only can we travel back up? No, I don't think we can. I think we only travel down on these zip lines. Oh look at him. He's so happy and ready. Okay, I, I said I would stop doing that. I'm sorry. Oh, there's another one of those Zoogla Booglas. Oh, this thing just kicked my ass. Come at me, bro. You can't come at me because you slowed down. I can't go that way. Scan? What are we scanning? Okay, so you can scan stuff for me. I can't get it to work. Huh. Oh shit, the bed. Run, 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 run. I don't want to fight another one of them. Help me. Somebody help me. <laughs> Alright. Maybe this one's weaker. How much do you want to bet it's not, though? Oh no, it doesn't feel any weaker. Whoa! I've beaten one of you before. I will do it again. Oh my god, it's stuck. This one feels a lot less aggressive than the boss was. It's not as... Yeah, this one's a lot weaker. All of that worry for nothing. Ah! These frogs are nothing. Scan this for me now. Thanks, sir. What's this? Ogdo. Okay, so we just have to beat one of these bad boys to get to where we want to go. And another safe point. Meditate. I don't think... We, no, we don't have any more skill points. It's funny, isn't it? Like, you can struggle with an NPC for ages and then you beat it once and suddenly... It's like your brain's like, yes, I know how to beat this now. This is easy. I don't know why you struggled for 17 hours before. Okay, so we need to go down here. Got some more bad guys down here. I'm gonna kill them just for the XP. Where are you going, little guy? Scan. He, he scanned some fish. Okay. Nice. Thanks, buddy. 
Is there nothing down there besides some things to kill? Yeah, I guess so. Uh, I guess my only option is to go down here. What was that? Some more scanning. Oh my god! That's what it was! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> like, what is that sound? See something in there? What's in here? learned a new skill. Oh. Try again. It's difficult, Master. Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. Okay. Let me go. Do all Padawan have the little rat tail? <laughs> Is this like a requirement to be a Padawan? Again. You must possess the force and a rat tail. Now, reach my position. Oh, nice. I did it. Hey. And the force is my ally. Just remembering old tricks. Can I do this? Can I come up here, do you think? I'm gonna go ahead and say no. <laughs> Is he still spying? Look, oh. It looks like later on I'll be able to swing along and maybe make our way up the. Okay, that's cool. Another time then. I like wall running though. I think wall running is cool. Nice. Think you can show me that shortcut again? Ah, oh, that's not accessible. Lovely. Wonderful. Yeah, but how do I get back up? Is it gonna be full of wall running? I think so. This area was used for meditation by someone familiar with the Jedi Order. Well, that's pretty cool. Okay. <laughs> well, clearly I wasn't supposed to do that. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh... Oh, there's a scan. A new seed. Uh, am I doing this right? Am I being stupid? I bet I'm being stupid. Oh yeah, I think I just need to go over here and grab this. Okay, much better. Can I go up here? Nope. Just uh, run back here. All beans. Can I use this as a means of running across? Yes, I can. Nice. And a chest. Choose you, BD1. So what was in there? A lightsaber switch. Nice. Oh, let's not go down there then. I want to go there. Can I go there? Perhaps not yet. Oh, hey guys. Just you and me now, boy. Just you and me. Oh, you're gonna scan for me. Nice. More info. 
that I'm never going to read because I'm far too lazy. Oh, look at, oh wow, look at them. That would be a hell of a fight to get to. Oh, you are a sneaky little ambusher, aren't you? I can climb up through here. I'm just going to check what's around that corner. <laughs> Look at it. Just rolling around like a dog. Oh, wow. Where'd you guys come from? He's just like a giant puppy, isn't he? Rolling around. Wants some belly scritches. What does this lead then? Does this lead somewhere? Oh, this leads up as well, I think. Yes, it does. Oh, wait, now. Oh, there was a little echo thing. Someone made camp here. They were excited to discover a giant creature that lives close by. A binog, they called it. A binog? I'm guessing that giant thing over there is a binog. Did I just go back to... Yes, I did. Okay. What a fail. Just went back to the start. Look at him. Do your little roll. Oh, he's not doing it. Up we go. There's more of you. <laughs> Like little Beyblades. Live Beyblade. Sorry about your scalping. Standing up to that bog rat? Pretty brave. Light new lightsaber sleeve. Can we go back across? Yes we can. Off we go. Aha, we're back here. Cool. We can go back to the temple. That is cool. That is a pretty cool ability. Games just need more wall running, I think. Racy there. Oh, it's on. He's so fast. We're not finished yet. Okay, okay, he probably would have won. <laughs> probably. Meditate. And I have a skill point to spend on something nice. I don't know what I want. Do I want a some more blocking? More force? I like oh they cost that costs two skill points. Hold left stick. How oh, to sprint and then perform a special lightsaber attack. I want this actually. I want to be able to dash to my. Yeah, that's cool. Can you use it up a little bit of force, maybe? Or you can jump over them. Oh, that's so cool. Scan some pottery for me, please. Hmm. <laughs> Let's go beat this, I guess. It's incredibly dark. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, nice. Amazing. Scan this for me.
You all right, BD? Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Ino Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault, is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Oh, that's Ahead, a big deal. You'll find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zepho once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. It's never easy, is it? I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. I'm not sitting in the water, man. What's wrong with you? Wet bum. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey. You want to meet some, uh, friends of mine? Hey, well, that's a pretty big fucking deal. To find a device that marks every force sensitive young person in the entire galaxy. Certainly not something you want the uh, Inquisitors to get their hands on. Because they'll either kill them or turn them into more Inquisitors. I I what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's a lie. Oh, it's another one of these fucking things. Do not have enough. Oh, why? Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> this thing is just hopeless. Oh! And down you go, you beast. Oh shit. Let's just heal up. Just in case. And zoom. I'm stuck. <laughs> it was hugging me. It's like, I'm not, I am taking you down with me. Stupid frogs are everywhere. They're pretty tough enemies, actually. All things considered. I mean, as much as I love this game, and I really do, I think it's, uh, I think, I think it's one of the best Star Wars games to ever come out. But I would have really liked, I would have really enjoyed, I mean, a proper open world game where you make your own character I suppose similar to Jedi Academy back in the day where you, uh, as you progress through the game, you get to choose like a new fighting style, whether you want like a single lightsaber, which you can ch uh, change stances with, Good job. or uh, like two lightsabers, so dual wielding them, or a, uh, what you call it, like a staff lightsaber thing, double bladed one, Darth Maul it, that would be cool. Darth Maul is one of the coolest characters, without a doubt. Can we go down here? It's locked. 
That's not opening. Opening from the other side. Okay. Let's take a look at the map. We've still got a few unexplored bits and bob. Okay, how do I zoom out again? Okay, like this. So there's a couple of bits here that we can visit. There's something underneath the ship. And there is also this bit. Okay, yeah. Uh, I just think I just want to explore a few more bits around here before we move on to the next uh, planet or location. What you got for me? My friend, it appears the Cepho had some interest in death of you. Strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. Dathomir. What would you find? What's wrong with the place? Ah, locked as well. Wait, did it just open? It did open! Ah, it takes us back to the start. How convenient. Should be a lot quicker than the way in. Wait, hang on. I don't wanna... Okay, that takes us back to that... Okay, yeah. Let's go this way. Mustn't forget to press left trigger as I jump. Otherwise he doesn't grab on. Cutie duty. It's down there. Been down there? I don't know. I don't recall. Isn't that where we fought the giant frog? I think it is. Don't tell me that you can come back this way. And then, uh... You can just attack it from above to deal... Like a huge amount of uh, a huge amount of damage. Uh, okay, let's go down here. This is an interesting one. So you go from that to this. Some pretty cool combos. I want to go back because I think there is one more thing this way. Yeah, there's one more thing there that we can still check out, and then we'll head back to the ship. I do only have one stim left though. Hopefully we don't run into any any particularly bad enemies. Let's go, bro. <laughs> I love this. I just love cutting them in half. I wish we had, like, lightsabers in real life. Imagine how quickly you can make toast. What is that? Looks like we can go down there. Okay, yeah, that's just the way to go. I don't know if there's anything else up here for me to check out. I hope one day we can go over there and say hello to the big doggy. Is there fall damage on this game? There is. I'm about to die. Ah! Stim crate. Should be here. Wait, can you carry more? Thanks, speedy one. Did we just unlock another stim so we can have a max, like a higher maximum amount? Ah, stim canister acquired. Nice. Okay, that's pretty cool. What happens if I go down there? Where is this place, first of all? Oh, I remember this place. This is where we had to go down there to acquire the uh, wall running skill. So I'm just going to go back up. because uh, That was marked red. So I'm assuming we can't actually do anything with that just yet. 
and I guess we'll head back to the ship. I don't think there's anything else for us to see here at the moment. It's one of those things that we'll have to come back to later on once we unlock more skills and explore a little bit further. I will just head back to the ship, customize our uh, lightsaber, and move on to the next location. What? It's a really pretty world, this whatever this is. I really like the, especially these creatures, they look so cute. They look like Pokemon. Oh wait, there's one more thing down. Oh, what you got for me? You want to scan that little hole, the barrow. Thanks Forgot for that there is this one more place down here. Oh, hey there, little guy. Hey there, little buddy. Ah, it's marked red, so whatever we need to get through we don't have. Okay. Maybe next time. Let's just head back upstairs to the ship. Maybe tinker with our lightsaber a little bit. See what upgrades we've got for it. Hello, madam. Pass the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> Get off my sofa! Get off my sofa! No! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stained out of Batoli meat fabric? <laughs> well, not really. <laughs> oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Breeze. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of four sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Is he just Jedi or Force sensitive users? Can bad guys view the information? Use the Force. This is Master Obi Wan Kenobi. <gasps> I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. It's With Kenobi. That list of force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zepho homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. <laughs> Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Death mirror Zepho. It's your choice. Where should we go? Where should we go? What's this? We can interact with it. Hey, What's this thing? What? Oh. You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy. It's only been like a day. Pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of embarring glass, 
That's perfection. <laughs> All right, I'll see if I can find any. Oh, we planted a seed. Guess we'll get a... We'll get a nice terrarium full of pretty flowers. I did say I wanted to mess around with the, uh, the, the lightsaber, which I'm guessing is back here. Meditation point? Yes, 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 yes. Color, can I change? Oh, orange, premium content. I think it's from the deluxe edition. I'm not going to lie, but I think I really, I like the default. Yeah, that one's cool. Hey, what's this one? This one? I like that. Let's go with that. Oh, look, the lightsaber looks damaged. I just I only just noticed. We'll go with that. We get to change the material. Let's go with that. Why not? Let's change as much as we can. While still while it still looks good. Oh yeah, orange. That's cool. Okay, well, uh, I think this is a really good point to end the episode. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and uh, comment below. And I'll hopefully see you in the next episode. Toodles.